Do you want to remove the background from an image in just one click? Just like this? Watch this video. Hello, TypeTrice here. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to quickly remove a background from an image in just one click. So without further ado, let's get right into it. As you can see, I found an image and let's say we want to remove this background. We could use the pen tool and create a selection around the sky, but that can take quite some time and there is actually a much easier way of doing this. There is this thing called the magic eraser tool that can remove a similar color background with only one click. So let me show you this tool. Before we start to remove this background, let's first take a copy of our image. That way we work non-destructive and that means that we can always go back and create changes later. And let's just hide this one. So we only got this layer active. Then go over to your tools panel right here. And normally it will be set to this eraser tool, but you have to right click and choose the magic eraser tool right here. Now when you are on your copied layer, you can now go up in the tolerance right here and you can change this number. The higher this number is, the more of the background it will remove. So if you, for example, only set this to 10, it will only remove some of the background. But let's set this to, let's say, 30. This is different from every image and every background, so I would recommend trying some different things out and see what works for that image you are working on. So let's just set this to 30 right here, and let's try to press on this blue background. And just like that, the background is now removed with only one click. This tool works for the most part only with backgrounds that have similar color, so if you have a background with a lot of different colors, this cannot always be that efficient. But in this case where we only have this similar blue color, this is a great way to remove background. It also works great with product images with a, let's say, green screen background or just a white background. Basically any color that is similar. So when you have clicked on the background, the image is now gone and you now have a copy. So you can always go back to the original. And that is how you move a similar background from an image. Thank you so much for watching, I hope this video was helpful, don't forget to subscribe and like the video. That was all for now, see you in the next one.